Okay, so we're gonna walk you through how to do a corner on an upholstered bench. Okay, so you have your corner right here. We have the corner from this side and the corner from this side. And what I did was pinch it together so you're along the diagonal. And the problem with corners is that you have a bunch of extra fabric that you don't know what to do with. And so we're gonna actually cut it out like this. I'm gonna cut along the long end of the bench. I'm gonna leave about half of an inch from the bench so we have a little bit of extra fabric to work with. And I'm gonna cut so I'm gonna start off only cutting the top layer of the fabric, and then I'll show you how to cut the bottom layer. So right now you're not pinching it together, you're holding the top layer out. And we're gonna cut until we get to the corner. Yeah, just about there. So now what you have is your cut side and then your intact side underneath. So what we want is to cut this side now. So we're gonna do the same thing. We're going to hold it this way and we're going to cut the top layer only, so just this layer, until we get to the corner. And I'm leaving it again about a half inch away from the bench. Okay, so now we have this funny little diamond shaped right here and our two nicely cut corners and you can kind of see that's going to line up really well. to cut just along this line right there. Basically, we just want to get this piece of fabric out of our way now. Okay, so now we have this nice piece of fabric. And the end is going to kind of look come together like that. So what we're going to do is tuck this guy in place, pull it nice and tight right there. You don't want to ruin all your hard work. So we're going to hold that, pull this nice and tight, and pop in a staple. And I'm just going to go ahead and cut this extra fabric out right here because I'm kind of OCD like that and I don't like bulk. But you totally don't have to do that because it's the bottom of your bench. And now we're going to take this end right here on the short end and we're going to roll it nice and pretty. And then we're gonna put in another staple up top. All right, and that is how you do the corner on an upholstered bench.